so good morning uh, let me show you how to work with the model sim uh, so you can just start working on with model sim like uh, you can go there and uh, double click on the model sim so this software initially to start up it may require some time so this comes from the altera model sim comes from the altera so once you come across something like this you can just give uh, jump start and uh, it will ask for creating a new project so of course if you are starting a new project go and create a new project uh, let me um, give something like this this is the project location um, let me give demo 100 so this is in C Altera 13.0 SPL so let's use like this so after this you can add project to this one I mean this is the project being created you can add a file to this one so you could see at the bottom C Altera 13.01 model sim A uh, it has gone to this particular location and the demo 100 has been created now let's add some existing file towards it so I am just browsing certain things or otherwise you can create uh, your own work so I am just giving an example uh, say some code I am having so let's run this um, matrix or VNR filter something like that so the code is it has been taken from this portion that is in this particular location and I have attached to that so now in this area you have created one project uh, demo 100 in this you have added this file now straight away go to first select this if you double click you will get the corresponding code at your right hand side yeah so this is the main code of it so this is the main code of it and these are the sub blocks which has been used so the top module is vnr filter and the matrix multiplication is the module which has been called over here now after you invoke this you go here and start compile compile all or compile selected in case if you have multiple files here we have only one file so you can give compile all so once you have compiled this you will get a green color uh, which indicate that uh, this particular file has been compiled once you compile in case if this has error say something like this let me change this and then again compile it so compile all so it has given a warning so you could see that uh, end semicolon will not come or in case if I remove this then again saving it and then go on compile it is expected to give error so it will say error which mean that uh, you have missed a semicolon here so again I am replacing that <coughs> so let me again recompile it so it, it shows very clear that uh, this transcript window it has been compiled so the top module for this is VNR filter so go to simulate start simulation in the start simulation go here uh, you need to find out this module name VNR filter 
let's see it should be in the W VNR filter yeah it's here so you can just give ok once you give this yeah it's corresponding input output signals will appear just to find out which are my input output signals you can even see from here input is mic 1 mic 2 then these are some of mic 1 mic 2 so these are my input so all from here you could see the corresponding input output also so this is the object window from the object window the arrow is pointing towards your right hand side it is input if the arrow is pointing from this point from the output point it is out if it is pointing towards the inward direction towards the input side it is input so these are 32 bits and the output is also 32 bit so let's try to give the input and i am just selecting the signals which are required so you can simply press shift key and uh, press wherever you want or you can select everything after you selecting it go to add to waveform selected signal so it will open in a separate waveform window once you get it open in a waveform window then you need to give test input for inputs so i am just trying to give um, the mic 1 and mic 2 test input you are supposed to give only for test input alone so it's a 32 bit so i am just giving a random input uh, 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 24, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32. Yeah. So this is one 32 bit. Again, one more 32 bit. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32. Yes. That's it. So you have given a value for A and B. So now you could see like uh, let's go and run this. It is F9 in the function A or you can simply run by pressing this button. So once you do this, you could see uh, the values for the output has been arrived over here. These are the two inputs W1 and W2 are my, my input and uh, these are my VNR route is the output, all the other things are intermediate signal. Say let's see, suppose if I change my input value, and then you are expected to get a different uh, value for that. Let's try to force a new value and again try to simulate. Yeah, you are getting a new value for it. So you could see when once I force this, a new value come in. Like this you can keep on going ahead. So this is the way to simulate any model sim file for this thank you for listening